Okay, so here's the uh, the landlord's rig. She's just likes having trouble getting in, and whatnot. But uh, so I'll do a little start up here. I know you're a goof if you do cold starts, but it's not really a cold start. It's just you know starting up the rig there. Give her the old the old run by there. The old uh, brake, emergency brake, and the fucking dirty shifter. Apparently, fifth don't work, so you gotta just rev her high and forth and smash her into sixth. So we'll see how we make out on the 907. Uh, this is one of the old sons of bitches. Got the old uh, engine kill and the uh, PTO engagement levers and whatnot, and stuff like that. So yeah, hopefully, uh, hopefully when we get there, we can figure out how everything works and. Uh, get this car and everything off and I think we gotta go pick up another car. Yeah! I can't even see over the dash. Yeah. What oh, crap. Holy. Oh, like, I got an aftermarket yeah. seat. Aftermarket. <laughs> <video. laughs> Son of a bitch. Yeah. It's like grandma friggin' bam, eh? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's like a school bus, eh? The friggin' steering wheel's like parallel to the friggin' ground here. But anyways, we're uh, gonna smash through the gears on the 907 big time. Yeah! Canada Catalyst <laughs> on, uh, on YouTube. That is one stand-up guy right there, buddy. I have no business at all driving this truck. Oh, I apologize, Andrew. You, you, I, I apologize. I don't know what else to say, buddy. We're going to stop at a Timmy's to re regroup. I'm going to block off a handicapped parking spot just because there's, I'm sorry, but there's nothing I can do about it. I have no business driving this truck. Oh. Alright, Bam here with another exciting episode of The Bottom Line. 
I'm on a uh, excursion here with my friend Pug, so I'm going to use his camera. Yeah, thanks, buddy. He's inside the, the Tim Hortons off the highway getting us a coffee. That's awesome of him. Your hard earned tax dollars. Well, I'm here waiting. You know, I was going to have a chooch, but I seen the camera and thought I'd give you guys, you know, what I get to look at. So when it bounces, you know, the seat, I get a little bit more of a view. But not much. Oh, you're a son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. With my friend here. I seen somebody was recording while I was in court. Yes, I am uh, going to do another episode of The Bottom Line oh, here. Oh, shit, not The Bottom Line with Bam. You guys are in for a treat. Yeah, buddy! I got to check a leak. I see some fluids dripping from the front of my landlord's van. Oh, truck you're... because I've been driving the ball bag off it. We're just so saying I'm gonna do you a little, have yeah, a little no... uh, parts check here, and I'll uh, give you the prognosis uh, when I return. Okay, while he's doing that, I noticed something. Since we're out of Tim Hortons, you know, can't be far away. Look at that. You know, it's never far away. Well. So they probably had, came here at the Timmy's. Now they're over there smoking a big fat joint. Oh no. Stone as fuck Hydro guys? No, no, stone as fuck uh, OPP guys. Oh, oh. Yeah, I caught him. I, oh. got, I caught him. I caught him. So here's your hard earned tax dollars smoking weed. Yeah. Having probably this. crack. They're probably yeah. smoking crack, not yeah, weed. Yeah, they can afford the good stuff, them guys. Okay, yeah. we'll go through the checklist here. Clutch in, e brake off, foot on accelerator. Okay, bottom line. Bottom line with Bam. Yeah, I better. Okay, I found first, so I'm not gonna pull her out of first just yet. This son of a bitch in front of us would go. Oh. Oh. So they're going back up. Oh. 
Oh, you got the inside scoop. Inside scoop. With Bam. Yeah. With Mug. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Big dirty beard. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. It's dummy in the tranny in this thing, buddy. Oh, this guy's probably gonna give me crap. Just dummy in the tranny. All right, so there's the uh, the van that I picked up. Use the stinger for that rather than drag it up on the flatbed. But uh, I got the receipt in there. We got 600 something for the, the aluminum shavings, turnings, and the uh, pop cans in the car. And there was a piece, couple pieces of uh, extruded in there. There's all the steel. All the steel we picked up. So it was $1,113 or $18 or something, I think, for the steel. I got the receipt in here, so might as well just show you. That's what we got for the car, right there. Car and the aluminum and everything. Car, aluminum, blah, blah, blah. And then so we got, it was a difference of 375.56 that I paid on top of that for the, for the steel. But uh, yeah, project, uh, project will commence here shortly. Yeah.